Hello everybody, welcome back to Farming Simulator once again, joined by the Northern Alex, the Formal Pickle, and King May. Everybody will be linked in the description below. You can check out their YouTube channels. It is early in the morning, two in the morning right now at my house, and the chickens are going nuts outside, so I gotta find out what the hell is going on here. Come on, open my door. Open my door. What y'all making racket about, huh? Good lord, man. Oh, y'all... They made actual eggs, I believe. It looks like y'all actually made some eggs. I, what are y'all going nuts about? What the hell's that? You see that? A red dot in the sky. What is that? I don't, I don't like that. Uh, yeah, I don't like that. I don't know what that is. 911, what's your emergency? Yeah, I'm uh, out here at my farm, right across from the uh, from the, the, the tractor supply shop, uh, and there's a red orb in the sky over here by my farm, and I don't I don't like it. My chickens are going crazy about it. Uh, can you send one of your officers out here? I just I don't I don't like that. Okay, sir. So you're reporting a unknown red orb in the sky uh, at your farm, and that's over whereabouts, sir? Uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm the farm right across from the uh, supply shop. In town okay, here, in county sir. line, shit. yeah, yeah. You, t you know, make that right turn there at Casey's, and then you keep on going, and then you make a look, if you're coming from the police station, and then you make a left on that gravel road on the left there. Uh, okay, but yeah, sir. It, it's it's just hovering there. It ain't moving. It ain't doing nothing. I think it's one of them UFOs. Okay, sir. We have an officer en route to your location. We'll be there shortly. All right. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know what the hell that thing is. Like, there's a tower there. It's just sitting there. I don't like that at all. No, stay in the house. Here comes the police. No, stay in the house. All right. Flash my light at him here. Over here, buddy. Oh, here comes. Oh, I think I know this one. Yep, this is Officer Pickle, I believe. Hey. Hey, how's, how's it going, sir? You call, well, uh... Yeah, well, I mean, you see right there, coming over the house right now, that that's that's an airplane, right? With the red light yeah. on it and all that. Yeah. Now come over yeah. here, okay? My chickens were going absolutely crazy, and I okay. came out to check on them, and, and it looks like they might have given some eggs or something here. I don't, maybe not. Maybe that's just a box, but they're going crazy. Man, I look out in that distance. You see that red orb? It's just been been hovering there, just sitting there. I do see the red orb. Is that the unidentified flying object you reported? Yeah, my chickens were going crazy out here. I came out here to check on it. I know it's two in the morning. And I look over there and yep, yeah, there's a red orb just hovering over there. It's just been sitting there for a long time now. Okay, sir. Uh, hey, come over here. Like I ain't I ain't I ain't messing around. Like, no, sir, I see it. I and, see it. And you can see the tower over there on the right. Like I know the red lights of that, but that thing's just sitting up there. I don't know what the hell that is. Okay, sir. Uh I'll tell you what. Let me uh, let me get on over there. I'm going to investigate that area. Okay. And I'll let you know so you can go back and get your sleep here soon. But I'll be right back. All I'll right. Go over there and take a look at it, okay? Uh, I sure appreciate it. Yeah, I, everybody in the house is all, you know, there's a whole ruckus going on right now over this thing. All right, sir. You just stay safe. Just relax. I'm going to go take a look at it, and I'll be right back with you. All right. All right. Take care now. Uh, let's get, yep, that's the ad officer. Okay. Howdy there. Hey, boss. I just want to let you know. Went over there and took a look at it, and you don't have to worry, all right? All right. Well, well what what the hell is it? Well, sir, it just seems to be some swamp gas and uh, grain silo off in that distance over there. Oh, all right. Well, I appreciate you checking it out. Who the hell is this on my property over here? Well, this is, this is a crazy night. You know what? This is a small town. We're, we're This is a quiet community, and now we got somebody just driving their tractor through my damn yard. What was that about? Where did they go? I don't know. They're I think they're hiding. Is that him continuing down the road down there? Yeah, still moving. You see that? Well, he was down here somewhere. The hell he go? Just came right through my property like that. Yeah, I guess he I guess he moved on. I don't know where he went. He was in a tractor with a big old yellow uh yeah, that yellow trailer on the back. I don't know what it was. Alright, a tractor. What color was the tractor, sir? Uh, I don't remember. It might have been green. 
Okay. Tractor with a big old yellow trailer. I'll tell you yep. what. We'll keep an eye out for it. I'll keep go looking around just south of your property here, but uh, I'll let you know if we can find him. But if right. not, uh, give us a call if he ever shows up again, okay? All right, I will. Yeah, if it's All red, right. leave it in the shed. If it's... Yes, sir. <laughs> Have a good day now. Oh, uh, so that's that red light. That's what he's talking about right there. Okay. Okay. I don't know what the hell swamp gas is, but... All right. Then I guess that's a believable story. I'll, I'll, I'll go with that one, I guess. Beautiful day on the farm. Uh, I actually have to mow my grass... Um, I do need to get a hold of you guys to help with fertilizing though, because my crops are starting to sprout a little bit. Let's see, oh yeah, that's coming along. Yeah, those probably could do with the spray. I'll get a hold. Man, what a beautiful day. I'll uh, I'll get a hold of these guys. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I heard you guys uh got a fertilizing little operation. You guys could help out with. Yeah, absolutely. The uh, co-op specializes in that. What you uh, what you looking at doing? Uh, I got three fields. I got one of oat, one of wheat, and one of barley. Uh, I'm at the farm right across from the uh, supply shop there. Seven, eight, and six. If you guys can help out with that. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and just start mowing my grass here this morning, but when you guys get here, let me know. Yeah, absolutely. We uh, we got everything ready to go, so we'll, uh, we'll let you know when we show up. And, uh, we can get that done for you. All right, sounds good. I appreciate it. All right. Well, there you go. I'm going to go ahead and get my mower going because I haven't mowed any grass yet. Open my garage door. Here's the old John Deere 332. <laughs> ah, yes. Oh, I can finally mow my grass. Yes. Been needing, been needing to do this for a while, actually. I know some people were like, why are you going to use that to mow your grass? I'm like, I don't know, because it's amazing. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. That's why. Yes, I'm being that guy. I'm I'm mowing my grass at like seven in the morning. But there's no, no neighbors you're... around, so it's all right. I was about to say you ain't got no neighbors, so <laughs> that's true. Oh, good. I don't know how Don't this worry grass... about waking everyone up. <laughs> <laughs> yep. You know what? I'm I'm gonna call my uh my buddy Alex. I think that uh, he might be able to uh, help with this fertilizing job. Let me call him up. Alex? Yeah. Hey, uh, I got a operation happening today. Some guys are bringing some, uh, some fertilizing equipment over, and I know you got some as well. You mind helping yeah, me with my fields today? You gotta talk a little louder. I'm on the 9X at the moment. Oh, okay. Uh, can you, can you, uh, head over to my house today and help with a fertilizer operation? Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm just gonna, f uh, finish here my roll, and then I'm gonna grab my, uh, my equipment and come over. Alright, sounds good. Alright, I'll see you after a while. Mowing my grass. Do, do, do. <laughs> oh. Hey, sir. Oh, hold on a second. Hold on. Alright, no problem. Let me go ahead and lift this thing up, shut it down there. Hey, how's it going? Hey, boss. It's Jake with the co op. Just thought I'd uh, okay. stop by, let you know that we're literally just down at the other end of your grain silos. We're here ready to go, prepping the sprayer. Um, I was told to come let you know that we were here ready to roll on that. So, all right. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, just those three fields that I uh, told your guy about. Uh, I have my yep. buddy. He's coming over with his equipment as well. We're going to try to just knock this thing out as quick as possible today. Just looking at it here, I don't think it's going to take us too long. Uh, we got a pretty big sprayer on it, so we should honestly be out of out of your hair here in a couple hours. Actually, probably less. All right. Sounds good. Appreciate it. All right, boss. I'm going to get back over there, but if you need anything, just give me a holler. All right. Sounds good. You know what? I could... I'm going to take a break from mowing here. I could go get mine and bring it up to the field as well. Maybe it'll speed things up. I got to bring my John Deere back all the way from that contract I did that had all the plowing that took like two live streams to complete. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, uh, I'm in the middle of nowhere now. That field brings back flashbacks. Oh, yeah. Lots of it. I was like, that's not a very big field. And it's like, yeah, <laughs> it was a massive field. I think we put three hours on that uh 9rx and that thing was rented right when we did it so we spent over three hours on it alone. oh yeah 
Absolutely crazy. I heard they were putting in a dirt racing track over there, and you can start to see it built up over there. Just to the right to get a damn lawn care company out here. This grass is starting to get a little obnoxious. <laughs> Just a little bit. Oh, that is a nice unit right there. Wow. That's how, that's how you fertilize a field and something like that. Not what I was doing before. Uh, I guess I'll put my plow back here for now. That'll work right there. And they'll have to run up and get a solid fertilizer spreader so I can put some lime, or a solid spreader so I can put some lime down. Well, this one's $39,000. I think I'll go with this one. All right, six meter spreading unit. Bye. There we go. Yep, we're, we're gonna take it. Sweet. Oh, who's that coming up the road? I think that's uh, Aviator Alexander. Oh, hey, Jeff. Oh, hey, what's going on? Oh, not much, man. Hey, just letting you know, we uh, we finished up all three of your fields for you, so got that done Already? pretty quick. Already? Damn. That's like... Yeah. All right. Well, how much yeah, do I owe you guys? Uh, it's going to be uh, 250 for today. All right, 250 All right. I'll yep. send that over. What, the uh, Pickle Farm? Is that what you guys are called? Yeah, Pickle Farm Co-op. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to... Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll have no problem with that at all. Hey, Alex, what's going on? Hey, how's it going? Ah, pretty good. Just uh, getting ready to load this thing up with some lime and get out there. I'm a little late to it, I know. I told you guys I'm a brand new farmer in the area. I've never never done this farming thing before, so I'm still uh, learning. Okay. To live, you learn. Oh, you yep. got a nice spreading unit there, eh? Oh, yeah. I, I, I didn't chintz around on that thing. I got what I uh, what I needed, so. Nice. I'm going to start spreading some lime, and that'll do it for me. But uh, how much do I owe you? Oh, don't worry about it. I have to test this thing out anyway. Oh, okay. Um, I just I just want to let you know here. Um, yeah. Well, for one, I wanted to know what was going on last night because I come by and I seen the cops in your yard and I was uh, driving well on that side. Oh, of is the that fence, you? To be honest with you. Yeah, it was me. Okay. I, All right. I yeah. I was just bringing my new cultivator down. I got you. Yeah, I was worried. Well, there was like a UFO hanging out over there, but it turned out to be, I don't know. They said swamp gas and, uh, <laughs> the, it's a swamp the gas. And the, and, swamp gas. Yeah. There and the, the grain silo that's over there. That it was just reflecting off in the night, I guess. I don't know. Oh, yeah. But that's what was going on with that. that All right, King. Sense. Well, appreciate the uh, the help, guys. I'll uh, I'll send that money over. I'll, I'll get the, the, the check over to him uh, later today. Absolutely. Not a problem. You guys have a good one. All right. Have take care of yourself now. All right, Alex. I'm going to get back to work. All righty. Sounds good. All See right. Later. Later. And I actually do have to fill this thing up with lime oh used all of that that was uh that was fast all right sweet i don't think i have enough lime well i mean that's only holding 36 percent of it but that wouldn't want i'd be all right i don't know let's spread this thing I'll fire it up and i've never done this before whoa that's pretty cool looking i think spreads quite a bit oh nice All right, and I got my first field done in limed. I have two more to go, but I think I'll end things here for sure. Uh, big thanks to everybody for hanging out and helping out with the fields today. I'll have everybody's uh, channels linked in the description below. Just the little app symbols, just click on them and you can go to their uh, pages from there. But that'll do it. I'll see you guys next time. Take care. I just wanna let you guys know that uh, merch is available. If you check out the link in the description below, and uh, there should be some images you can click on below the video as well. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. I do appreciate it.